Welcome back to Restore Thrive. We're talking about improving your walking and running and lower body mechanics. That's a lot to cover, but we're gonna do this in a very simple and effective way. Today what we're gonna talk about is a weight shift with frontal plane movement. So the idea here is when we're talking about the way the foot moves, the foot is not just a hinge joint or a flipper that moves forward and backwards. It has a little bit of rotary capacity to it, has a little bit of frontal plane movement to it as well and if we're trying to restore the foot to its normal state of being which means it can supinate and pronate we've got to work in all three planes of motion so what we're going to do today is start you in a square stance have you get out and do a stride position if you watched our other, vid other video on sagittal plane stride stance and weight shifting what you'll know we're trying to do is we're trying to take our front leg we're trying to get our knee to trace in line, our instep or our big toe, as we shift our weight forward. What we're trying to do there is let the foot pronate a little bit by bringing that knee over the inside of that first toe. Now to work the frontal plane as we shift forward, as we bring the knee forward, what we're going to do is raise the opposite arm overhead and then come back into that start position. I should feel my weight on that front leg going into my big toe and that first big toe knuckle as my arm goes overhead as well and then my weight comes back to my heel as I shift back. I'm just going to move forward and back here about 10 to 15 times on each side. Again, trying to get just a little movement of that arch so it gets a little bit flatter as my weight shifts into the middle of my foot. And again, what we're trying to do here is just restore a little bit of that motion in the foot so it can pronate and soften up before we get into toe off and then becomes that rigid lever. So give this one a try at home. Let us know what you guys think. We'll talk to you again soon.